Alan Boyd was already seen as vulnerable. Um, this is a conservative district, uh, and you know this this anti-Obama uh, feeling out there. Um, Alan Boyd voted, ended up voting with the Obama administration on health care. I think that hurt him. It's kind of ironic because Alan Boyd has been one of the most conservative Democrats in Congress over the years, and the conservatives may be turning on him a little bit. But he is someone who occasionally votes with the Democratic Party, so the Republicans would, would, would like to pick that seat up. They see it as a seat they could pick up because the area does tend conservative. It's the panhandle from basically Panama City to Tallahassee, parts of Tallahassee and everything in between. This is peanut farms and watermelons and, and, uh, and the coast. And, um, and Alan Boyd was already seen as vulnerable and the Republicans were already going to put a bunch of money into that race. And then State Senator Al Lawson almost knocked Boyd off in the primary. It was about a 52-49, 51-48, somewhere in there. Boyd barely hangs on and now the Republicans are salivating. They see Boyd as really vulnerable. So Sutherland's going to get some help from Washington.